Good day, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Our devotion for today can be found in Luke chapter 2, verse 48 to 49. It says here, So when they saw him, they were amazed, and his mother said to him, Son, why have you done this to us? Look, your father and I have sought you anxiously. 49. And he said to them, Why did you seek me? Did you not know that I must be about my father's business? In this scenario, Jesus was only 12 years old. But what he did is so amazing. He was listening to the teachers and asking them questions. There are two amazing things here that Jesus did. First is, at his young age, he was very bold to listen and ask questions to the teachers. In verse 46, Now it was that after three days they found him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the teachers, both listening to them and asking them questions. This verse reminds us that our Lord Jesus is so fearless even at his young age. So are we also as disciples of Jesus Christ must be bold enough to listen or to do what the Lord wants us to do as his followers. But sad to say many are old enough or mature enough in age but still afraid and fearful of doing things pertaining to God afraid of what they will say against them afraid of saying the truth because it may be break the good relationship to others and many more compromising reason as a result of fear but this verse reminds us to be bold enough to tell the truth no matter what they will say against us as long as we follow the word of God. Second amazing things here Jesus was shows us to be submissive and honor our father and mother. Down to verse 51 Then he went down with them and came to Nazareth and was subject to them. But his mother kept all these things in her heart. So are we also, as a disciple of Jesus Christ, we must be submissive in our parent and honor our father and mother. But this word also reminds us to be submissive not only to our parent but also to the people used by God as our leaders and elders because as disciples of Jesus Christ we must have the character and attitude of submission so in conclusion brothers and sisters in Christ we must be loyal and have the integrity in our stand as followers of Jesus Christ do what the Word of God says and tell the truth even if what they will say against us or especially in the word of God be bold enough in God's word as Jesus Christ did so are we also thanks and God bless you all